Good morning. So far, sorry, I've like been breaking out into hives for like two weeks. So all I've done so far this morning is brush my teeth and took Rocky out to go potty. And I fed him and he ate a little bit. So now I'm gonna make my coffee. Say good morning. Say good morning. Say good morning. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to eat more of your food? Look how small he is. I'm obsessed with him. I wish everyone in the world could meet him. Just kidding. I don't want anyone to meet him because I want him to be mine. Also, I haven't really looked at myself this morning, so if I look a little bit scary, just mind your business. This is our Nespresso thing. So this, I have to fill it up with water. Okay, so I'm just going to like go down here. So as you've probably been able to tell, I'm an extremely low energy person. I have little to no energy at all times. So I need a lot of caffeine and even then I'm still low energy. Do you see why I can't do like aesthetic things? Because I just like jammed this in. Probably broke the whole machine. But anyways, so I'm very low energy, very tired all the time. I think I've already mentioned this, but Dylan's family got us the machine and the pods. My mom got us the little espresso cups, so it's really a family effort. Okay, and then I like iced coffee, so I like to put it in here, and then I do another pod. Okay, and usually during this time, Rocky will try to run away, so then I have to go find him. So I'm just going to finish doing this really quick. Okay, the camera's like chopping my head off, but this is what I put in my coffee. I put oat milk. And then I put some honey. Oh my gosh, okay, Hunchback of Notre Dame. Geez. And then I put some cinnamon, just for some pizzazz, you know. Okay, so I stir it around a little bit. And then I just add ice cubes. I add a lot of ice cubes. Also, my hands are clean. Okay, thank you for making my coffee with me. So I made breakfast. The government called me, so that's why I didn't film my breakfast. Basically, I started up a company, <laughs> got the EIN number, set up a bank account, did the whole nine yards, except I spelled the name wrong. I spelled the company name wrong, so then I got over it. I was like, well, I can't start a company with a misspelled name. So then I just decided to not do anything with it. Okay, so then a few months go by, then I officially dissolve the business so that I could avoid all the fees because I never even did anything with it. And then I got a letter in the mail saying that I have to pay a fee. So then the guy, I called the guy or the, the government, I don't know, the tax people. There was a wait, so then they called me back. And then he was like, well, we're just a collection agency. We're not like in charge of making the decisions. So then I was like, well then, well, you sent me the letter. So he was very nice though. The call failed at the end though. So that was unfortunate. I didn't even say goodbye to him, but yeah. So then I had to fill out a form online. It's just very confusing. I just feel like the government makes it as confusing as possible. So then people get over it and then just end up paying the fees because they don't even want to deal with the hassle on a side note so for this like past week you could maybe even tell in my last youtube video i was kind of just in like a weird wave i don't know and then last night it like hit me that i was like entering like a depressive episode if you will so then i just decided to like go to bed like i felt it and i was like hey if i like stay up i just will get more in my head whatever so then i went to bed this morning, I'm like making a big effort to like pull it together and I'm feeling fine right now. Knock on wood. I haven't really gone into like a depression in a while. So trying to hold up the streak. Okay, so I ate my breakfast and that's about all I did. And now I'm gonna do my makeup. So first I start with putting on my moisturizer. I have nothing on my face before this. Also, I don't have a mirror. I'm just looking in my camera to see what I look like. So, oh, that's why we need a mirror. So then I go in with this. So that's that. I'm only going to do a little bit of this. 
Okay, now that I've done that, I use a different IT Cosmetics CC cream that's in a lighter shade. So the one that I put on my whole face is neutral medium. And then this one is fair and I'm gonna use it for concealer kind of. And the reason that I'm doing this is because my other concealer is the Tarte Shape Tape and it's like a little bit too fair for, for the color of my main CC cream. It's just like a little too light and it just looks a little, I don't know. So I'm just kind of putting it on the spots where there's like maybe a little bit of redness. Then I take the Nudies. It says all over face color. It's in shade Deep Maple A. I do just a little bit of this. I used to do a lot more or like if, if I'm going out or like that type of thing, then I will put more. But for just like my day, <laughs> just for like today, for example, and I just want like a lighter look, then this is what I do. And too, you'll see like when I blend it out, it doesn't look that much. And my eyes. And then for highlighter, I either use the Becca Cosmetics or what's it called? Just Becca, I guess. I either use this. I don't even know if Becca's still like a thing anymore, but I still have this. And then I also bought the L'Oreal Lumi Glotion and sometimes I use that too, but I'm just gonna use this right now. I just take a brush. So then also what I do sometimes is I use the Bare Minerals Loose Powder Blush. Rocky wants to be included too. Now the last thing that I do is eyebrows. I've been using the Anastasia, Anastasia, I don't know how to say it, the Brow Freeze Styling Wax. And then I just use a spoolie. You kind of have to act fast because it will like dry. My eyebrows are not even, just like they're not even in general. So I don't try to make them look even because they aren't even and there's just no point. Okay, well, I'm gonna get my day going. Hola, hello again. So I took Rocky on a walk and got dressed and now I'm at the bank. I know that I talked about my business, my failed business. Anyway, so now I'm at Chase bank because I have to close my business account and put the money back into my regular account. On another note, I am feeling very hyper emotional. I don't know if I'm about to start my period. I don't think I am because I feel like I just had it like a couple weeks ago, but like maybe I'm about to start it again, but definitely feeling the vibes. I think tonight Dylan and I are hanging out with Claire and Evan. So that should also cheer me up a little bit or it'll probably cheer me up a lot. All right, I'm gonna go into the bank. Wish me luck. I'm back from the bank. Basically back in May, I started this business. So then I go to the bank. I transfer money from my personal account into the business account. Then I just got over it because then I was like, the name is spelled wrong. This is gonna take forever. I don't even wanna deal with it. So I get over it, I never use it. Recently, like maybe like November, my dad was like, well, Quincy, you need to like transfer the money, close the account. So I try to close the account on the Chase app, but it says you cannot log in because because whatever. So I haven't been able to log into the account. So fast forward a bunch of blah, blah, blah. I go in here today and I explain to her the situation. She logs into the account. She's like, um, this account has been closed since August. So I'm like, okay, well, can you still just transfer the money? She goes, there's no money in this account. So now I'm wondering where my money went. So anyway, that's how today's going. I forgot what I filmed last. Basically, I got home from the bank and then I played with Rocky for a little bit, sat outside and it's four o'clock now. So I already took Rocky on a walk today, just a little one around the neighborhood, but I have been wanting to go on a walk on a trail or like at the beach or something like that, or even just like sitting outside like at the beach. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready. So I did not get to go on my beach walk because Dylan wants me to pick up his minivan. With me, Clarence. You, you act like I want you to go pick up by yourself. <laughs> you, should, you should clarify. He wants me to walk. You and I are going to do that. You guys want a detail? Why is that? You think you're some sort of comedian? I absolutely do, actually. Can you help? Can you carry something? And you leave your wallet in the garage over there? I've had such a long day. Okay, okay well, I have two. What, laying down for 30 minutes? It was only 30 minutes. Such a Mr. Bossy Pants. 
Hey, um, is William there? We just picked up the minivan. Here it is. Beautiful. And now Dylan had to go to the bank. I have a little man here. This car is trying to park next to me. They're literally about to crash into us, but you know, it is what it is. Oh, she gave up. Right now it's six o'clock. We are going to dinner with Claire and Evan around 7.30. All right, I'm ready. Love you. I love you too. Oh, Bye. he wants you. Bye. Bye. When we were at picking up the minivan. Dylan took Rocky to go show him to someone and he came back and he was like, Rocky peed all over me. And I was like, that's weird, I'm okay. But then Rocky just peed all over me. In the car. So I don't know what the hell's going on with him because he's not usually peeing all over the place. I take him to go to the bathroom. It's not like he never goes to the bathroom. Right there. Thank you. That's a cute camera. Thank you. <laughs> hey vlog. It's Claire. And? And what? And my name is Evan. And we are so excited to meet you finally. I got, I'll tell you, I got an enchilada with shrimp. I got the street tacos, carne asada. Pretty good. What'd you get? Why'd I got a quesadilla. Hello everyone. I haven't made the bed yet. Don't look at it. Today is now Saturday. Dylan and I are about to go to Orange because he has to drop off a car there. So I have to like follow behind him. So kind of me to do that for him. Dylan just got home. Last night we went out to eat with Evan and Claire and then they came over for a little bit afterward. We had a wonderful time. Rocky and I have been hanging out. But yeah, so now I'm gonna get dressed. Okay, here's my outfit. Looking glamorous as ever. I have my queen shirt that my dad got me for Christmas. And I'm wearing these leggings and slippers. Whoa, whoa. to announce that I've decided to pursue my musical career. So we made it to the wheel warehouse. Dylan is such a crazy driver. He drives like a race car driver. Like he always thinks he's on a racetrack and I drive like I have a baby on board. So the conflict of driving styles really causes some issues. <laughs> Rocky pooped at the wheel warehouse. I took him out thinking he would maybe just pee, but he pooped, which is good. <laughs> He's just a baby. Hey guys, so I'm back now. We finished. <laughs> we came home and then we ate lunch. I made a delicious meal. I made salmon and salad and rice. Dylan! Anyway, now we're going to my parents' house to go for a swim because it's about 8 million degrees outside. It's 63 and... degrees outside. Oh, okay. Do you have anything to say? No, let's go. Do you know how much hate I get on the daily saying, Dylan is so upset with you in all of your videos? Yeah, I care about what those people say. Well, you, could act, you don't act like that to me when it's just us. And then right when I do this, you act like... This is how I treat you all the time. I don't know why you keep lying and putting on a facade. I am so mean to you all the time. You want a smarty? So my beautiful friend Natalie, her mom, made this beautiful necklace for me for my graduation. And she put money on it and smarties. Once in a while when I need some sugar, I just- Or money. Or money. <laughs> <laughs> I just go over to this little necklace. It's just for a little snack, a little pick-me-up. Hi, hi Louis. Jackson, what schools have you gotten into so far? Clemson, LMU, Pepperdine, SMU. Mom, what schools have you gotten into? School of rock. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, 
so it's about 8 30 p.m i showered i shaved we're back at home and dylan invited people over and they're downstairs i have not made an appearance yet because i am so tired okay here's the difference between an introvert and an extrovert an extrovert gains energy by being around people and an introvert is drained by being around people but anyway i think i'm gonna end this vlog now all right i love you guys thank you for watching my videos see you on the flip side the flippity flip